The price of the brick went up. Hey, hey, hey. We used to rap it like that! Hit this area with 51. Everything in the butterflies. Go get your man. And I feel like butterfly gonna recap this. So all oh, y'all wanna know what happened, I'm gonna tell you what happened. He got smoked. The boy been solid when you ask about your Mac and hard. Always on the line in the trenches like a nose guard. Never been a sucker, man. My knuckle game crazy. Leave your eye like a raccoon, punching them out like the baby they say. He a G and he know for keeping it 100. Dirt on my boots, not my name. He so 100. Pay full quarters. I sold two halves and I often fast. I seen fiends recover from everything, but I never seen them rebound off the glass. Nigga, that was a quick. <laughs> Remy um is my uh is my fucking um, entertainment manager now. So yeah, so but now all bookings gotta be styling that hunt now. You digging them saying? Thanks. Jury know what it is, man. Salute to the subscribers, that notification gang, etc. etc. Don't let none of that get too far ahead of you. You know who I be. Follow me on IG. Got my guy with me. Showtime that's Peter, nobody that knows bodies. And first of all, before we get started, if you respect the handle, subscribe to the channel. We're trying to push this thing to 80,000. We got some special things coming when we get to that 80,000. We right around the corner. You know what I'm saying? We don't really ask for much or tax for much. So uh, give us what we ask from us. Um, let's get right to it. So, easy to block captain. Man, this guy has taken over Battle Rap News, Battle Rap Media, Battle Rap everything. You put his name in there, you're at 10,000. Out the door, right? He has been at a war with like all of the URL rappers, you know what I'm saying? Like he's got a, it's like him versus like five or six right now, you know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah, definitely shooting. And he's shooting back and he's <laughs> shooting at him. Uh, Hustle's tweeting, raise your hand if you're, not in the, if you're not in a contract. Raise your hand if you're stuck in a contract where you can't even battle over there no more. Like she's wilding on him and he's wilding on her. Raise your hand if you took the battle from Rock, from you are, from Remy Ma, your best friend. Like he going at her, she gunning at, like it's just, Shots fired all day. It could be literally 10 blogs a day, but you know what I'm saying? It, it's one of these things where it's like this, right? Now, Easy to Black Captain, mm. who we will be talking about the Joe Budden podcast in another joint, mm. has now uh, made a, a crazy power move. Mm. He just signed. He just said it. He said it on Three Letter Man. Salute to my brother, Three Letter Man. You know Salute. what I'm saying? I seen him out in Atlanta. He was making moves, and he was just at Chrome 23 getting around. Good to see him doing his thing. Mm. He was interviewing Easy today, and Easy said, uh, he signed to Remy Ma's entertainment. So now that's his entertainment manager. Somebody who been in the game, knows how to make moves. He just got a crazy bag with and probably gonna get more crazy bags with. Cause now she's, now if, <laughs> if URL wants to put, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me get this, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me get together, hold up, hold up, hold up. Wait a minute, hold up, I'm gonna slip like my sneaky slide. Let me get together, hold up, hold up, hold up. Hold up. Mm. So now, if URL wants to book this nigga, mm -hmm. they have to call her, yep. who they didn't even want to battle over there, to get him to, to this shit is crazy. Is this crazy? Am I bugging or what? It's on you. It's definitely some spooky, uh, that's a, a spooky finding. You know what I'm saying? No. When, when you call it's a somebody. Discovery. It's a discovery. Yeah, definitely, yeah. So, like, you know, when you make a phone call and you call easy and all of a sudden the number gets transferred to another number. Oh, man. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That's like, that's like, that's like you trying to hit, uh, hit up your mans and come and find out your ex girlfriend answering the phone. Like, why, wait, whoa, why she answering the phone? I, don't, mm, I used to do, I don't like dealing with that. What, and what, I want to say this what's about going on I want to say this about Remy Ma, you know what I'm saying? Uh, I know niggas is critical, you know mm -hmm. what I'm saying, about what went on in the event and all of that, but I'm going to tell you this, though. I said in another video, I'll say in this video, too, you know what I'm saying? Any league, that type of shit goes on, niggas is going to talk about it. Like, it just is what it is, you know what I'm saying? That's just what we do. It's going to happen. But I feel like what she's doing for Battle Rap is dope because she's provided opportunity to, to, to have big battles, to make a bag, to be on big pay-per-view, to get... YouTube drops, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying, which is real critical to these guys' exposure. She got a lot of uh, industry connections, you know what I'm saying? Like if his music gets popping, she could help, she could jump on a track. I think it's such a good thing what she's doing for battle rap. So that's why I said after we originally spoke about what had went on and they said they addressed it and they're going to deal with it, mm -hmm. I left it alone, you know what I'm saying? I ain't going to keep riding on it because it's like, yo, 
what she's doing for Battle Rap is dope. And when I watched her interview with Three Letter Men and how she was breaking it all down and what she want to do for Battle Rap and the things that she got going on, how could you not respect that? If you can't, the whole perspective is whack, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So um, I can definitely see this as a, a, a power move on Easy's behalf, mm -hmm. um, mainly because he got the push and got, you know, he, he literally in the talks and walking around with somebody who people deem as you know of the upper echelon, like it's it's bigger than it's bigger than just battle rap. Yeah, she got platinum records and everything. You know what I'm saying? All the so, way up, triple platinum. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Like, so gold like record. it's plaques. You know she's got it's plaques. Pla and when he go to that moves. house, it's plaques on that wall. You yeah. know what I'm saying? And then Pampoos, touch it, it remix. You know what I'm saying? Like they 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 done made their mark on the industry. What I'm also saying is, and you ain't said it yet, so I guess I get to say it. You know, shout out to. Her constituent, you know what I'm saying? Now that mm -hmm. Remy Ma is his manager, yesterday's price is not today's price. I'm gonna say, I mean, and, yesterday's and, and, price. You calling it? You, I mean, like, listen, who he gonna ask? He gonna ask her. That's price. It. It's not, not today's, today's price. price. That's all I'm man. saying. That's all I'm saying. You gotta, you gotta pay, man. You gotta pay. You gotta pay like you wait, man. It's, uh, it's also a, a, a another plus for you know for Remy because of the fact that you know maybe after an event like this, you know maybe sitting down and taking a, a breather from you know trying to be a, a league owner. Nope, we are gonna nope. double down. I'm gonna put my investment in one of these guys. And you know what like, that is? You know what that is? That ain't nothing but the Bronx. I'm gonna tell you. I'm gonna, hold on, let me get this, man. You know what I'm saying? I, I got to get this one. You know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? That ain't nothing but the Bronx. That ain't nothing but New York. And I'm gonna tell you what it is, right? The resiliency of a lot of New York people, like we could take a L, we could take a step back, we could take a loss, but the fight that you're gonna have after that mm. is gonna be crazy. And then every time it's gonna be elevated and elevated. And ele like the Bronx, like that's just how niggas are. They're gonna continually have that hustle. And it's like, you know, you know, it was, it was a couple little hiccups, but for the most part, the whole stream was good. It just fucked up at the and end. Then, I mean, you know what I'm saying? They're gonna get it right. I, I, have, I have confidence in the fact that they can get it right. But her being able to now sign or have MCs under her management is a power move. You know what I'm saying? It's a power move. Because I, sure. I heard, you know what I'm saying, when he was arguing with, uh, not arguing, he's going back and forth on Twitter with Twerk. Mm -hmm. You know, Twerk and other people was like, oh man, but you signed a little flip. You know what I'm saying? And here's the deal, right? I'm going to say this about that. Um, while Lil Flip is not like the biggest artist anymore like that, you know what I'm saying? He had his run, he did his thing. You know what I'm saying? He's a fan of battle rap. He's providing the opportunity. Now I see people who say like, oh man, you signed to him. Like, what do you got going on? But I will say that uh, they can't say that about Remy. You know what I'm saying? Like, like you can't, you, you won't be able to say that. You know what I'm saying? Like, she ain't got no motion. You know what I'm saying? She could jump on the track tomorrow. She was just on surf album. So. Respect, respectfully, mm -hmm. and, uh, of course. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm sure a little flip is very heavy for the South. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Especially when it comes to Texas and, and, and you know, Houston people know there. Houston alone, Houston, PA, and 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 um and uh think Dallas, whichever is the closest one around that area. That's a whole market in itself. And he was fucking with uh, he was fucking with Philly Heavy because Reed did a project too. You know, yeah, what I'm saying? So, you know what I'm saying? Like, so like it's not like and Cassidy was also along those lines too, if I'm not mistaken. But, like, they, they had no the but the reason why I'm saying that is maybe there are doors that open up down there, but where Easy is in Philly, and if he's around that New York area. This is kind of that market that he might want to, you know. That demographic. Yeah, so well, yeah, it might be a better fit for him. Not to mention, you know what I'm saying? Remy got it, got him on the Joe Budden uh, show before. And after. And after, you know what I'm saying? So it's like. Like, she can make them calls, the Hot 97 calls. Yo, I got an artist, I want to get up there on Funk Flex. You know what I'm saying? Like, some, she can make them calls. You know what I'm saying? Some, and, then, and then some calls get answered faster than others. Yeah, they're going to answer the call faster. You know what I'm saying? So it's just like, it, it, I, I, it, I don't think there's anything wrong with with what may be going on. Um, the only thing is now, you know what I'm saying, now that, would that, all right, so obviously, you know, Hustle is not, you know, signed to Remy, you know, right. kind of, but we know there is a connection with Hustle and Remy. So now when it comes to Chrome 23, are we now guaranteed, well, I don't want to say guaranteed, but is it more of a shoe-in where we know we will see Hustle and now we know we will see Easy? Right. That ain't hurting the brand either, you know what I'm saying? Right. So. It's also smarter to sign them as artists yeah. than, than to, to sign to them, 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 to yeah, sign yeah. to the league. Like mm -hmm. you can only perform in the league. Maybe nah. that's a better option. I don't know. I don't, I don't I, think the whole. I, you know what? I, I and I will say this. I think, and I feel like you know mm -hmm. what I'm saying. Butterfly. I feel like mm -hmm. um, the, the 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 leagues have an artist in a 
in a, in a, in a tight grip. Mm -hmm. I think those days are about to end, man. You know why I think those days are about to end? Because artists are now showing you that they don't care about contracts. They get they they want to get out. They want exposure. Cause I feel like the app is only conducive to the URL. It's, very you know it's, it's very only exclusive. exclusive. It does not benefit the artist. And I said it many times, and I'll say it again. The app does not benefit the artist because the artist is not getting any exposure to the general public. Everybody ain't got eight dollars a month. Not everybody ain't got that. Well, some people just don't want to do it. Well, some people can't go to their wife or their girl and be like, "Yo, I'm buying this," and they they struggling to pay the. And some people just don't got it, right? So mm -hmm. here's the deal. Some people just want to go on YouTube. You know where I seen him the first time? On YouTube. You know what I'm saying? That's the first way that I seen him. Him versus Swag Tanner on YouTube. I seen him versus uh, Clean Paper, YouTube. Him versus Twerk, YouTube. That's where I got to know this guy. Not, you know what I'm saying? So my thing is this. If you if you tying cats in to such a long period of time, they're not getting exposure, and then they can't go battle somewhere where they can get some exposure, what are you doing? What do you, what do you, what is the benefit? You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm asking like, what is the real benefit? It's, it's, it's also a hard sell too. You yeah. Know? Especially if you're, if you're, uh, if you're, if you're still a battle rapper, right? And let's just say you want to branch out and branch off and try to do, you know, get into the entertainment mm -hmm. room. The only thing you can show on your portfolio is an app that only battle rap enthusiasts no, have. No, no. You get what I'm saying? So like imagine imagine how small that circle is. Well somebody saying, yo, let me get let me get an example of your work and then you can't even send them you a link. You ain't got no link, link then. These niggas like I don't link. You got a link, but you gotta pay eight you gotta pay eight dollars just to no get resume. that. You know what I'm saying? No the suit the suits the suits are not gonna gonna do all of that. Right, that resume. should be available to me. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Or it's a it's a word of mouth type thing too, but once again, because battle rap is also a very closed market I mean, uh, like it's a very uh, small circuit, mm -hmm. small circuit. Uh, mm -hmm. So with that, you're already fighting to show that exposure. You're showing somebody something that they've never seen before, and then you got to tell them how important you are in that realm. Hitman Holla doesn't have to do that. No. Charlie Clips doesn't have to do that. No. Sharon ain't got to do that. Ar like Arsenal does not have to do that because so any of these things this. is is a rank. Let me ask this: scale of one to ten, how much of a power move do you think this is for you? I mean, it's definitely. It's de I mean, what? A eight, nine, at least, at least a eight, nine. Eight, I would say that because, you know, it's 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 a guarantee. Their their moves can be made, and it's and they're showing already. So. And I think they've all happened in concurrence with one another. Like the battle happens, the result of that battle happens. Now this situation happens, and then it can, you know, what I'm saying it can grow because you can't just. She's not pushing her chips to the center of the table if he don't win the battle. You know what I'm saying? Like that's another thing too. It's also what you know. Even though it, the the blogs are always uh, oh why did, why we you know praise it easy is only because he ain't dropping the ball. I just told y'all. Has not. Would you? Would, would he? You can battle rapper A can say whatever they want to say as long as they produce the product that they say. It's all a bravado. It's all saying mm -hmm. that I'm the nicest, and here's the results of that. Easy is showing y'all the results of that. You know what I'm saying? Bring me your best, and I'm going to go ahead and kill them. Not make it a debatable. Not make it a fun battle. Not make it a 2-1 either way. Clearly winning. Mm -hmm. That's another. That's that's one major factor that you got to have in play, is that you got to be clearly winning. Right, right. Yeah, yeah. You got to. That's the thing. Winning is important because winning changes everything. You don't think for one second that there are people who are on the other side of the fence or in another league that are watching this battle and like, okay, let's see if he lose. Because if he lose, then we can say, we told you. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Yep. You didn't want to respect same. the part. This is exactly what's going to happen. You know same. what I'm saying? And then it's, uh, the same way we, we, we uplift you is going to be the same, same way you <laughs> coming down. Right? We ain't going to have no, it, it's no excuses. It can't be no excuses. Do you think she, uh, We'll get some more fire artists. You know what I'm saying? That's gonna want to be on the same kind of, kind of, kind of path. You know what I'm saying? I mean, there's a there's a very good argument for hustle. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like there, there's a couple of them out there. Oh, and when they was going back and forth, he was saying that I had something that was going. You know, oh, oh, because he was going at her for missing the face off. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, that's what he was going at. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, like yeah. it's a it's a tough it's a tough argument for hustle when when you're saying. Uh, 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 signing to Remy like that would, I wouldn't expect it easy but I would have started noticing that 
once I see him on the Joe Budden podcast. So it was like, mm. yeah, because she did bring him up there. She, you know what I'm saying? But she, that was her main event. Though. She didn't bring Hustle that was her main event. She didn't bring But that was her main event, though. That was her she main didn't event. bring A Ward. But well, respectfully, that was her. I hate that word. She didn't I, hate, I don't even like saying this shit. Uh, I mean, Real talk. That, but, but, you know what I'm saying? She did bring her not, up there. That was the main event, though. You got to have that promotion. But was Hitman on Joe Budden podcast? Yeah, what's they was there together? They, I thought they was there together the first time. Or they wasn't? No, they, uh, no, Hitman wasn't there. <laughs> I'm about to say no, 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 Hitman was not on no Joe Budden. They were just saying he was going to lose. They was just saying Yes, that's it. That's it. That's it. Yeah, my bad. No, 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 sir. No, sir. They had him on the phone on the next yeah. joint. We'll talk about that we later. We definitely will talk about that. But, uh, but, no. I think her signing, I think him signing her is a power move. I think it's, uh, it's very dope for battle rap. I think that, uh. Yeah, no, no. I don't see him on it. Okay. He's just talking about the battle, but I did not see him. But signing to her management company, that is a major move. Major move. Because now, in order to get him, you got to call her. And now she going to be like, the price of the brick went up. Hey, <laughs>